Friends, here our concept is how to install Python 3.x and Boto 3 on Linux server. So here we are installing Python 3.7.4 on Amazon Linux server. Same steps you can follow on RHL and CentOS server as well. Now let me launch a new Amazon Linux server. So just go to launch and select any one of the Amazon Linux. I am launching this Amazon Linux server with very basic steps. Just launch it. Just wait for some time uh, to get the status as up and running. And one important point is by default, you will get one of the Python version on your any Unix or Linux like operating systems. And don't disturb the existing Python version because your operating system depends on that default Python. That's why don't disturb that existing Python. Then how you can install your required Python on your Unix or Linux like servers. It's very simple. I will show the steps. Now let me connect with this server. Now just check it. Uh, is there any Python or not? Yes, there is a Python. Let me check with the Python hyphen hyphen version. There is no Python 3. Let me check with Python 3.7 hyphen hyphen version. There is no Python 3.7 as well. Now we need to install our required Python 3.7.4. So first switch into root. Now go to a browser. Just search like install Python on RHEL 7. So just open the very first link. So I will provide this link on the below of this video. Now observe here. Before installing your Python, you have to install some dependencies. So just copy and paste the link. Then you can go to any location. Just I am going with this location. So here just download your Python 3.7.4. So once it is downloaded, just extract it. It has been extracted. Now, go to that extracted Python 3.7.4 and then configure it with enable optimizations. So, let me copy next step make alt install. See, we are also having make install command, but if you use that, there may be a chance to disturb the existing Python version. But if you use make alt install, it will install alternate python version. So it will take some time, you have to wait for that. So once it is done, then we will see your python 3 version and pip 3 version. I am pausing the video, once it is done, then I will show you. So it is about to complete the installation steps.
it is almost done so it has been installed your required python and also your pip3 as well first let me remove this downloaded and extracted fine now go to see first let me check it python hyphen hyphen version so we have default 2.7.16 we are not disturbing that now let me check it python 3.7 hyphen hyphen version we installed but you are unable to get the version see by default your python is installed under user local bin just go to there and list see just now we installed this python 3.7 and your pip3 right now let me run the, in this way dot slash python 3.7 hyphen hyphen version yes you are having then dot slash let me check with pip3.7 hyphen hyphen version yes we have now to get easily uh, your python 3 and python uh, pip3 just i am creating a soft links under slash bin location so just create soft link ln hyphen s let me take complete path user local bin in this we have python 3.7 so that i am going to create a soft link as python 3 i am renaming it as python 3 simply now just check with python 3 hyphen hyphen version you are able to get it your required python version the same way let me create soft link for pip3 as well so pip3.7 i am creating under bin location slash bin location now check it pip3 hyphen hyphen version that's it fine now let me enter into python 3 terminal see simply if you type python on your unix like systems you will enter into your default python version but i need my python 3 then type python 3 then enter now here try to import boto3 yeah boto3 is not there because we know that Boto3 is not the default module for your python we need to install it now let me install it pip3 use pip3 if you use simply pip it will install your boto3 in python 2.7.16 i mean in the default python of your os but we need to install boto3 under python 3 that's why use pip3 pip3 install boto3 just i am giving hyphen y for confirmation sorry hyphen y is for m right so this is pip3 just run pip3 uh, install boto3 it has been installed let me enter into python3 then here try to import boto3 so that we can verify yes it is there now let me show you one more thing let me enter into python2 and if i try to import here boto3 there is no boto3 because we installed boto3 for python3 so this is the simple way to install your required python on your linux servers thank you